start fuel levies must be cut to ease the burden on consumers reeling under rising inflation the latest inflation data based on retail and wholesale prices are yet again flashing cautionary signals as spilling cost continue to dog the pandemic hit economy stop cpi based inflation stayed stuck above the rbi's 6% upper bound for the second straight month with the june's provisional annualized 6.26% only a touch slower than the 6 month high pace of 6.3% registered in may stop inflation at the retail level was largely propelled by sharp increases in key food item prices including oils and fats which surged almost 35% from a year earlier and gained 2.9% from May's levels as also egg which jumped 19.4% year on year and 6.2% from the preceding month and pulses and products which climbed 10% from june 2020 stop as rbi officials reviewing the state of the economy in central bank's monthly bulletin released on thursday observed fuel inflation which excludes petrol and diesel surged to a record 12.7% in june driven by lpg kerosene and the rural poor's mainstay firewood and dung cake stop and disconcertingly lpg and kerosene prices have also registered increases so far in july stop transport costs remain persistently high as both petrol and diesel prices continues to rise with the former now averaging rupees 102.92 a liter in the four major metros as on july 12 and diesel at almost rupees 94 according to the bulletin article stop with global crude oil trending higher the unabated rise in domestic transportation costs in bound to reflect in retail prices of firm produce and products shipped from factories stop wholesale prices inflation also stayed stubbornly high at 12.07% in june after may's record 12.94% as price gains in the fuel and power category soared 32.8% annually and those of manufactured products edged up to 10.88% medium and small scale industrial units already struggling to cope with the pandemics impact on demand and overall finances now face rising raw material and input costs stop with manufacturing activity contracting in june for the first time in 11 months as for ihs markets pmi the economy is visibly struggling to regain traction in the wake of the second wave which has eroded demand and consumptive capacity in both urban and rural markets stop add to this the looming possibility that this year's monsoon rains may be less than adequate either temporarily or especially disrupting agricultural output and the outlook for both inflation and growth gets significantly clouded stop with cumulative rainfall since june 
being 5% below average in 12 weather subdivisions spanning 37% of countries area experiencing deficient rainfall as on July 15 and the pandemic still nowhere near under control the risk of precarity and hardship rising in the rural hinterland is very real stop the government must at the very least cut fuel taxes to ease the burden on consumers stop